Hi, this is Candy Production. Today we are going to make the good dinosaur. With either you can use Model Magic, Sculpty, or clay of your choice. So for mine, I'm making like a smaller version. So for his head, I did like this weird sideways shape. I don't know. It's a weird shape. You'll have to just like look up a picture like we are. So then I made like a long neck because Arlo does have a very long neck. And next I'm going to start on his ovally shaped body. To make Arlo's feet, you're going to want to get a piece of your clay or whatever it is and roll it into a ball. And then you kind of want to flatten it. It kind of looks like a foot. It wants to be kind of longer on one side. So I made his like ovally shaped body and I attached it all and made it nice and smooth so you don't see any of the lines because if you bake it and the lines show then I don't think you could get rid of them and it would not look that cool. Um, so now I'm going to make his four legs and make sure you make four of them. Okay, so I added his four feet as you can see right there. And now is the time you would want to smooth out all your edges. Anywhere that you see that you need to smooth it out, smooth it out. And next I'm going to add his tail. So let's get to that. So I added his tail and he kind of looks like a puppy dog like my friend said. And this one that I did, I used Sculpey so it says that you have to bake it. So I'm going to bake mine and then paint it green and also paint on his eye. So this is what mine kind of looks like. It doesn't look too great, I must say that. And this, it's, it would be easier with clay, I must say that. And it's really hard to put all the limbs on with making it still look pretty well. So that's my final product. So I also did the little indention for his mouth because I thought it looked really cool and it would make him look really cool. And I said cool twice, whoops, whatever. Um, for his eyes, I'm probably gonna put them like on so it shows indention, like, I mean, yeah, indention. So it's like they're popping out of his face and like they're not just flat on his face. So I'm probably just gonna put them on with clay and then paint it once it gets out of the um, oven. So yeah, that's how you make Arlo from a good dinosaur out of clay. Um, I think we're going to show you what they look like after they're done baking, but let's put them in the oven. Or let's. So I made like little eyes so it looks like they're popping out instead of like just having them right glued to his face. So I'm going to let mine bake in the oven now and then I'm going to paint it. Okay, so we let ours bake and one of them had to air dry and Model Magic doesn't really work that well. It kind of leaves cracks and stuff. So if you don't want yours to be cracked, like most people wouldn't probably, then you should use the air dry clay or you have to bake clay. And now we are going to paint our dinosaur. Okay, so I'm painting my good dinosaur now. And once you finish painting him, you will have done your um, <laughs> dinosaur. And you can do this any way you want, any color green you want. We just like had this color, so we used it. Actually, we had darker color, and we mixed white with it. But after you finish that, you can add like white and black to his eyes so it looks more lively. And then you have finished your good dinosaur. So we also put glitter on ours to make it like more fun. And so now you have finished your good dinosaur. We really hope you like this, and please watch this with your friends and share it with your family and anyone you know. And if you liked it, please click the like button, subscribe, and comment. We really hope you liked it, like I just said. <laughs> and we'll see you in our next video.